Congratulations. Thank you. Thanks. Um, we kind of planned that English wasn't going to run this anyways to save her for the final, so I mean, I was expecting it this whole week, getting ready for it mentally, so I wasn't surprised at all. Was it clear you were going to be the person if she didn't? Um, you know, Coach Johnson had a, a plan in his mind, and we just followed whatever he said. And he didn't share his plan with you? Not really, he just... Let's just know right before. Getting ready for it physically too. Yeah, definitely. Is this you like that first? approach? Four by four? Uh, no. I've run with them a couple times, but uh, this is probably like my third time running it this year. How did it feel? <laughs> it's hard, like always, but it felt good. Uh, the fans are behind me and really helped me get through that race. English mentioned the same thing that Robert tells you guys right before. Mm -hmm. You like that? Not finding out until right before the race? Um, I mean, I'm used to it now, so. Uh, you know, we, we just get mentally prepared, so if it happens, it happens. If it doesn't, then oh well. What was your reaction to, to seeing English in the 200, clearly hampered by an injury? Um, we actually didn't even see it. We were on our way over here, but we heard about it, and our whole thing was we're just going to pull together and do that much better as a team and cover the slack that she won't be in the 200 finals. Laura, you had a, a pretty good leg there. Um, you know, both of these two put me in the perfect spot. Like, I got in second, right behind Florida. So uh, they set me up well. All I had to do was kind of follow, and um, that last 120 is use my 800 strength. And Coach Johnson told me to put us back in it. We were already in it, so why not give Phyllis a little cushion? Because there's going to be some good anchors coming after. Her, so. Tell us there was some heat on you as you came around the curve. Did you feel them and, and you feel confident you could pull away? Um, I felt really confident that I could pull away. Like, if I was counting on my team to like get me through and make sure they gave me a cushion, and they did. They did an outstanding job um, doing executing that plan. And I'm really proud. And, and my goal was to take it on home. Did you know that there were people? Coming on you there as you came off the turn? Um, a little bit when I looked at the screen on the home stretch, I was like, oh my gosh, but it was good. I just, we just wanted to qualify. For your final tomorrow, does English in, English's injury give it any more urgency? Obviously, the, the goal was to win anyway, but any more urgency seeing what, what, what English, how she's running? Um, Yes and no, because we always pull through when one of our teammates are down, we always like get together and step up our game to like make sure we can succeed and win. So we're pretty good at that. Laura, how, how about for you in the 800 tomorrow? Is there any more urgency for you to, to score a big point? Hey, Laura, before you answer that, anybody else need Jen or Chi-Chi? They, they need to get going to cool down. Thank you, Jake. Laura? Yeah. Um, you know, had a couple mishaps at Pac-12, I think it was Paul starting, and you know, we picked up the slack, like Phil said, and we did it just fine. And we don't really know the circumstances surrounding English yet, but whether she's running or not, we're going to pull together because, like she said in her interviews, we want it. And, you know, we set goals. And one little, like, which one says, ebbs and flow, one little ebb in the flow is not going to ruin the whole game plan. We still got a goal in mind, and we're still on track. So. Injuries notwithstanding, are you guys starting to look at the scoreboard a little bit? Um, you know, we don't worry about the points or anything. Uh, the coaches worry about the form charts and the points. We just worry about performing and focusing on doing what we can control. So, Have you guys talked to English since that happened? No, we haven't. Anything else? Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys.